Welcome back. Nice to see you and it is my pleasure to have you here. Today's recipe is to, to stir fry celery with shredded squid recipe. Hope you like it. This home cooked dish is very delicious because it contains dried squid shreds. Shredded squid is a dried, shredded, seasoned seafood product made from squid or cuttlefish, commonly found in coastal Asian countries, Russia and Hawaii. Welcome to subscribe my channel and save this recipe so you may refer back when you need this recipe. Stir fry shredded squid celery. Ingredients, celery, shredded squid, ginger. Shredded squid wash and set aside. Peel and sliced carrot. and sliced celery. Chopped ginger. Stir fry chopped ginger until fragrant. Add shredded squid. Add carrot. Add celery. One tablespoon oyster sauce. One teaspoon salt. Add to tablespoons water and stir fry. Plate celery. Crunchy celery tastes great and appetizing. It goes well with rice. A. E. Squid shreds are rich in protein, as well as vitamin A, vitamin E, folic acid and minerals. Squid is rich in calcium, phosphorus and iron, which is beneficial to bone development and hematopoiesis, and can effectively treat anemia. 
In addition to being rich in protein and amino acids required by the human body, squid also contains a large amount of taurine, which can inhibit the cholesterol content in the blood, relieve fatigue, restore vision and improve liver function. The peptides and selenium it contains have antiviral and anti-radiation effects. Celery cannot be eaten with the following six foods, seafood, celery, soybeans, pumpkin, chrysanthemum, and rabbit meat. Eating celery and soybeans together will reduce the body's absorption of iron and induce anemia, so they should not be eaten together. Eating celery and pumpkin together can easily cause diarrhea, bloating, and indigestion for patients with poor gastrointestinal function, so they should not be eaten together. Eating celery and chrysanthemum together can cause vomiting, and severe patients may also suffer from food poisoning, so they should not be eaten together. It is best to eat them separately. Eating celery and rabbit meat together may cause hair loss, or aggravate hair loss, so they should not be eaten together. YouTube Friends who like cooking may consider following my YouTube channel for more delicious recipes. If you can please give me a like which is the greatest encouragement to me. Thank you all. Hope you like my recipe sharing. Do share out this delicious recipe with friends and family ya. Yeah. I will upload bilingual video recipes every day. Chinese video will be uploaded at noon while English version at 8.30 p.m. Welcome to follow and save recipes you like. Remember to follow my channel so you will be able to find me when you need cooking inspiration. There are three thousands of delicious recipes on my YouTube. Check it out for more delicious recipes ya. Yeah. There are three thousands of delicious recipes on my YouTube. Check it out for more delicious recipes, ya. Yeah. I share delicious recipes every day, so don't miss it. Thanks for watching. See you in next video, ya. Yeah.